Welcome back to Legendary Tributes. Annabelle Gamson was an American dancer and choreographer. Although she worked in ballet, Gamson was particularly known for her work within modern dance. As a dancer, she drew particular acclaim for her interpretations of work of Isadora Duncan, Mary Wiggum, and Eleanor King. She died on August 1st at age 94. Fred W. Hurd was an educator, a politician, and an Episcopal priest. He died on August 1st at age 82. Raymond Stewart Wood Jr. was a bishop in the Episcopal Church in the United States of America. He served the Diocese of Michigan from 1990 to 2000 as its ninth diocesan bishop. He died on September 1st at age 89. Paul Adrian Brodeur Jr. was an American investigative science writer an author whose writings have appeared in The New Yorker, where he began as a staff writer in 1958. He lived on Cape Cod. For nearly two decades, he researched and wrote about the health hazards of asbestos. He also wrote about the dangers of household detergents, the depletion of the ozone layers, the microwave radiation layer, and electromagnetic fields from power lines. He died on August 2nd at 92. Constant Darnowski was an American hurdler. She competed in the 80-meter hurdles at the 1952 Summer Olympics and the 1956 Summer Olympics. Darnowski died on August 2, 2023, at the age of 88. Mark E. Noenig was an American politician. He served as a Republican member of the Montana House of Representatives. He died on August 2, at 75. Charles Hardy, known as Hungry Charles Hardy, was an American competitive eater from Brooklyn, New York, USA. Hardy was a long-standing member of the International Federation of Competitive Eating. During the latter half of 2004, Hungry Charles displayed dominance in eating, placing second and third in major events throughout the USA. Hardy secured victory for six consecutive years in the Civil Service Qualifier for the Hot Dog Circuit and maintains records in sushi, shrimp, and cabbage. He died on August 3rd at age 57. Adrian Vaughn was an American businesswoman and publishing house executive who was the president of the publishing house Bloomsbury USA. She also worked for Disney, where one of her projects was managing Marvel Press. Vaughn died in a boating accident in the Fiordor de Fiore in the Amalfi Coast on August 3rd at 45 while on vacation with her family. Richard Mead Goody was a British-American atmospheric physicist and professor of planetary physics at Harvard University. He was inducted in the National Academy of Sciences in 1970. He died on the 3rd of August at 102. Charles James Ogletree Jr. was an American legal scholar who served as the Jesse Clemenko Professor at Harvard Law School where he was the founder of the school's Charles Hamilton Houston Institute for Race and Justice. He was also the author of books on legal topics. Ogletree died on August 4, 2023 at the age of 70. Richard Edmund Hartley, mostly known by his stage names, Slim La Hart or The Wheeling Cat, was an American country music singer and entertainer. La Hart is best known for his tenure as a member of the original Wheeling Jamboree, WWVA, the second oldest country music radio broadcast in the United States. LaHart first appeared on the Jamboree as a guest in 1965, alongside fellow musicians Charlie Moore and Bill Napier. Until he died in 2023, he maintained status as a lifetime member of the Jamboree, with a star bearing his name outside the Capitol Theater in Wheeling. He died on August 5th at 88. Robert Swan was an American actor. Swan began appearing on film and television. Swan is best known for his roles in Hoosiers, The Untouchables, Natural Born Killers, and Backdraft. He also worked as a voice actor for television commercials and founded an opera company in Three Oaks, Michigan. He died from liver cancer at his home on August 9, 2023 at 78. Stanton Arthur Waterman was an American cinematographer and underwater film producer who was a five-time Emmy Award winner. He died on August 10th at 100. Alexander Cole Jr. was an American professional baseball outfielder. He died on August 17th at 57. 
Gregory Lewis Trothalis was an American track and field athlete. He set the best world year performance in the men's shot put. Thirtieth at age sixty eight. Gail Jenkins, Lady Jenkins, was an American film, television, and stage actress. She made more than thirty film appearances. She died on August thirty first at age eighty. That's a wrap for today. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up, share, and subscribe to the channel to see our latest content.